Hello everyone and welcome. Today I'm going to bring you my um, Color Mates Cosmetics collection. I'm going to start off with um, the very first one I ever got. And I purchased this one at Deals. When it was Deals, now it's Dollar Tree. But Dollar Tree does carry these. Um, this one has no name. It didn't have a name on the packaging because I remember. And this is what it looks like. Oh, again, that's Color Mates. Comes with a sponge tip applicator and brush on the other end. Six eyeshadows that have heart imprints on them. These little squares. And on either side, there and there, those are blushes. Hold on, there you go. It's a peachy tone one. It's a mauve. And underneath the blushes, I have Libby's pink and red. I'm going to swatch these and um, I'm ready today. <laughs> I have my wipes and I have a towel so I could dry off my arm. Okay, I'm going to start off with the shadows and I'm going to swatch them in order. I'm going to make them big enough so you can see them. Like skimpy swatches, right? <laughs> I have nothing on my hands or arms, like lotion or anything like that. Because when I'm going to do swatches, I wash my hands all the way up to my elbows. The last one right here. And those are the shadows right there. I love that shadow right there. It's so beautiful. And there it is in order. Oops. There you go. The eyeshadows. I'm going to take a makeup remover wipe. My fingers. Try off with the towel. And I'm going to do the blushes. Peachy toned one. So pretty. I've used that as an eyeshadow. Well, I've used both of these blushes as eyeshadow. And you guys know how I roll, right? And there they go. It's this blush and that one. Very pretty. I'm going to my fingertips so I can blush. <laughs> Excuse me, so I can blush. So that I can swatch the lippies. I'm going to start off with the pink one. If you were wondering if they're pigmented, um, yeah, they most certainly are. Good. <laughs> this is Color Mates Cosmetics. The red one. Mm -hmm. Yes, indeedy. The pink and the red. And this is the very first ever Color Mates Cosmetics palette I picked up from Deals. I'm going to move on to the next one. And I like this concept better. The first ones they came out with, they have other shadows, um, excuse me, other palettes, other colors, but this is the only one I picked up. But I love this concept of the blush and the lippies as opposed to these were the newer ones they came out with. I also got these at Deals, but they sell them at um, Dollar Tree. And this is what this one looks like. It's a lippy and a glitter like gel liner right there underneath silver. These are the shadows. Another lippy, another gel liner. It's a silver and gold. So I'm going to start off by swatching the shadows. I'm sorry, um, 
These four palettes have names. I cut it off the packaging and taped it on the back. Party Brights. First one had no name. But these next four I'm going to share, they do have names. These are lovely. And there they go. Same order I swatched and that's how they appear. I'm gonna grab a fresh make <laughs> remover wipe because yeah. Dry my hands and fingers. Now we're gonna go in on the lippies. That's one, the bean is the other. So yeah, um, color mates, pick them up at your local Dollar Tree. This is insane. Is it? Lip glosses, believe it or not. Mm-hmm. Um, now I'm going to do the, I think they're like gel liners maybe, I'm not sure. But I've tried using these and yeah, it's like Vaseline glitter in it. This is a silver and this is a gold. Let's watch them right here. They're very slick and odd. It's the only part of the palette I don't care for. Looks pretty, but like if you use it for liner, prepare yourself. <laughs> do I recommend you do so? No, no, I do not suggest you use those as um liners. Nope. So again. This one was Party Brights. This next one is in Daytime Delights. What is Daytime Delights? That's what Daytime Delights look like. It's a lippy there. I, I don't know what that is. It's a hot mess. That's what I consider that. And the other Libby. So let's swatch these. These last two um, blue shadows I have not used yet. So I'm excited to do so. This is the shadow I was talking about. Depending on the base, if you use a base underneath, it's uh, like holographic. It might seem white and then pink, yeah. Oh, there they go. And these are the last two blues I was talking about I have not used. I think I haven't used them. And there they go. Swatched in order. And I'm gonna swatch the lippies at least. But and they may look very similar to the other ones. But it's all good because they're beautiful. And you know what? I'm I'm done with swatching the the gold and silver because they're all the same and they feel the same. And yeah, it's just that these um, last four palettes of this style all have the same like Vaseline with glitter on to it. Weird but again this is um daytime delights. Now this next one is in glamorous nights. And that is glamorous nights. 
You see what I'm saying? They all have the silver and the gold. Yeah, what I consider a hot mess. That's what they look like. And do glamorous nights. This is also another holograph, but this one's pulling more pink. Very beautiful. I believe it's a black. Yes, it is. It's a matte black. Showing up really well at the end. Now we'll take the lippies. One swipe of that one. And wow, that one hasn't been used. Look at that. And one swatch of that one. A swipe of each. Wow. It's so beautiful. There they go. I am missing a shadow on here, huh? Oh, I forgot to swatch that blue one right there. Okie dokie. <laughs> This shadow shows up on the palette before that black one right there. That's what they look like. And again, this is Glamorous Nights. Gorgeous. Okay. Let's wipe all this off. They're stubborn, huh? It's a good sign, though. To me, it's a good sign. Let's try the fingers in the hand. And last but not least, from these palettes, is my favorite, and it's Neutral Notions. Again, I did the same thing with all of them. That's what I usually do with. Um, a palette or shadow doesn't have a name on it. Uh, if it has it on the packaging, I'll cut it off and tape it down. And this is Neutral Notions, and this one's my favorite from the four. And when you see it, you're going to see why. Yep. This lippy has not been touched. As you see, a few of them, that was the case with a few of them. So let's get to swatching this palette. It's my favorite. So pretty. Some of the shadows on camera might come across as looking similar, but I can assure you that is not the case. So it's Gorgeous. My goodness. Kind of blends into my skin tone, but that's okay. I have to wipe off one of my fingers in order to get the last shadow. Dry it off. Oh, that is so pretty. Okay. And this is Neutral Notions. And this is them swatched. I'm really digging that one right there. Kind of blends into my skin tone, kind of. That one and the one right beside it. That one's pretty to look up. They're all beautiful. Please, they <laughs> I love them all. Okay. One swipe. And one swipe of the red. Mm -hmm. Pink and red. Gorgeousness, my friends. Gorgeousness. <laughs> so I make sure I get all this stuff off. Okay. And those neutral notions. 
also from deals I had picked up these color mates palettes like this and these are five shadows and I don't have the name but did have it on the packaging so I cut it and taped it and this is bright eyes bright eyes it comes with a long double-ended sponge tip applicator and that is what bright eyes looks like let's get to swatching bright eyes so pretty very pretty too far up to the side hold on there you go and that my friends is bright eyes swatched in order lovely so yeah that was bright eyes picked up three of these I already like this one this one is on um, seduction I did a date night look at this one I don't know if I recorded it, but I did use it for a date with my husband my goodness it's insane one swipe it's like a metallic white a little bit of silver in it perfect for date night. This is so pretty. Yeah, I definitely should have brought my glasses. Ooh. Seduction. Again. And it's the swatches of seduction. There you go in order. So pretty. These palettes, you can find them, like I said, at the local Dollar Trees for a dollar. And it's awesome. I really like this concept, like I said, better with the blushes and the lippies and the shadows. I hope they don't come out with any more of these, like with that gel, whatever that is. Yeah. Color mates, if you're watching, don't do it. <laughs> don't do it. All that is is a hot mess. Okay, wipe my fingers, my hand. Last but not least, this is my favorite from this style, and this is Copper Shimmer. This one is named Copper Shimmer. Let me try my hand. Let's get to swatching Copper Shimmer. That's one thing they don't disappoint, and they do last. At least. Let me speak for myself. I I do always keep it on eye anyways. On my lids, they last. And I have oily lids. There's no big secret. Just use a primer. Primers are to help your shadows stay on longer. Mm -hmm. That's what they do. Certainly. And that's copper shimmer. I love this color here. And um, I have a little swatch in the back of my head. That's a good look. Gorgeous. I say a lot of people think that um, they're full of shimmer or glitter. Sometimes they might have a light spray over them, but no. they're 
beautiful. And like I said, there's no big secret for having them lasting on your lids. Just use a primer. Yeah, just use a primer. Like I said, the purpose of a prime, an eyelid primer, and some of them do bring out vibrancy in your shadows, which is great. But the purpose of an eyelid primer is to help your shadows stay on your lids. So if you use a primer, it should be straight, right? Yeah. It's worked for me. So, <laughs> last ones I shared with a five pan little palettes I got for a dollar. Yeah, they have more of these. And the first palette I shared, with the blushes and the lippies, they had more of these. I, let me take that one up. And, darn, this lip broke on me. It's okay. And these, a dollar. A dollar. How could you go wrong? How could you possibly go wrong? One dollar. You can usually find these, like I said, at your local Dollar Tree. So if you see the color mix, they also have a little eyebrow kit that I haven't tried that I'm not going to because you guys, if you haven't watched my eyebrow arsenal, go ahead and check that out. I have tons of <laughs> stuff on my brows. So my local Dollar Trees all carry it. They have an eyebrow kit. They have, they have all kinds of stuff. It's a, it's a nice line. So again, that is color mix. And that is what I own from Color Nights. Thank you for watching. I do hope you all enjoyed. May God continue to bless you and your family as always. Until the next time, may you all stay blessed, beautiful, and ciao.